How does CLAN work? Let's say that you have a security team with golf carts. How do you track them? Well, first you plant an RFID tag, which is a chip the size of your thumbnail onto each card. These RFIDs can record many things, like if the guards are moving, how long they are stopped, and their geographic location within the physical network. This data is sent to a cell, or multiple CLAN cell sites via radio transmission. This allows the intelligent CLAN network to locate the RFID tag and respond or transport its monitoring information to the appropriate monitoring point. Aerial mapping systems can display location and track movement within the range of the network cell sites. To show how this works, let's take a look at an overhead view of a system right now. A basic tower grid is shown on these points. The additional dots are other towers where cell sites are located. The circles represent the radio range of each cell site when communicating with RFID tags. For optimum coverage, the covered circles need to be overlapping, like in this system. Okay, so now that this data is in the system, how does it get to where it needs to go? The cell site, located within a solar beam tower or in a standalone solar-powered configuration that use very little energy, can be located just about anywhere to provide RFID coverage. Once the cell site has received the information from the RFID tag, it is transported to the master control point in the network. The master further directs the data to the appropriate system within the internet, CLAN-based server, cloud-based application, mobile device, or other monitoring point. Beyond localized fleet tracking, SolarBeam is able to customize these systems to customer needs including detailed asset tracking, both indoors and out. Let SolarBeam show you how we can provide these resources via CLAN and help provide a safer and more efficient working environment for your team.